Good morning, Remnant Connection. God bless you. This is Jackie in Oregon. Welcome back, my dear friends. Thank you so very much for your prayers, your kind comments. You folks are so precious to me. We have such a wonderful family here on the channel. There's so much love. I feel it through, you know, through the airwaves here. Praise God. Um, you know, I'm excited because today I go to my post office to my postal box, you know, and I'm sending out my first mail message today. And I'm excited and I'm excited to hear your feedback, what you think. You know, I believe with all my heart, us truth speakers and us truth seekers will be removed, you know, from this platform. And this mail ministry will be an outlet uh, for the truth to be flowing back and forth between us. So if you haven't gotten your uh, post, uh, your address in, please do. And I wanted to thank you so very much. If you are being blessed by these messages, there's two ways to give uh, offerings on this channel. The super thanks in the comments section. And also you can forward cash through the mail. And then once, uh, once I have your information, I'll return all of my information to you. I'm very, very thankful uh, for everything that you folks do for me. I so appreciate everything. So today, remember what I'm saying, truth speakers and truth seekers will, the closer we get to the end, we will be silenced. Amen. They cannot have the truth going out and we are inching closer each day. And that's why I felt this male ministry is becoming, will be even more important to us. So let me know your feedback. Amen. So today's word, today is actually Friday that I'm, you know how I work ahead. Today is Friday the 26th of April, but this is another one of those words I'm going to move ahead because I think somebody or some of you need to hear this word. It's a, I've classified it as a word of knowledge and I've titled it in this time of decision, in this time of decision. And I have just a brief scripture today. It's not a long scripture, but I think it's right on the money here with what we're speaking of. So Philippians 4, verse uh, chapter 4, verse 4 through 9, rejoice in the Lord always. Again, I say rejoice. Let your forbearing, and that would mean gentle, gentle spirit, be known to all men. The Lord is near be anxious for nothing, but in everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving, let your requests be made to the Lord. And that's this is the scripture, the verse here that's very important for this word. Uh, verse six, be anxious for nothing, but in everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving, let your request be known to God and the peace of God, which surpasses all of uh, comprehension shall guard your hearts and your minds in Jesus Christ. Verse 8, finally, brethren, whatever's true, whatever's honorable, whatever's right, whatever's pure, whatever's lovely, whatever's good repute, if there is any excellence in anything worthy of praise, let your mind dwell on these things. Praise God. So keep praising, church. In the midst of your time of decisions, keep praising, right? Keep praising the things you have learned and received received and heard and seen in me practice these things and the God of peace shall be with you. Praise God. Okay. In this time of decision, in this time of decision. Okay. Uh, Philippians 4, 4 through 9. There is none like you, my love. You are my all in all. When you are with me early, I know you will be with me late. I need you so, my love, need you so. There is no end to your mercies, new every morning. Today, my love, is a day of many decisions. I seek your wisdom early. I long for only your voice, uh, your will in a crowded and noisy world. I lay down before you, my love. I pray only for your will. This is the day I lay all before you. I have struggled and pondered long enough my love, how often we just worry and fret and ponder. Amen. This word right here, this is the day I lay all be for you. I have struggled and pondered long enough. Now, my love, I give of my, I give 
up of myself and hand over all to you. And I know in your perfect timing, I will hear your voice in this matter. I have no solu solutions in my fleshly mind. I will not give up. I know you are with me. You know the way forward, glory to God. Often, my love, there is a time when the answer is just silence. So important. Often, my love, there is a time when the answer is just silence. Amen. A time of praying, a time of waiting, and a time of trusting. Today, a day of many decisions, a, a time when my mind says you must move now in this direction. Oh, my love, my faith now being tested and tried as never before in the past. And yet you are with me. Your spirit moves within me from past days until today. And you will lead me in the future. Glory to the Lord. I am thankful for your days. <clears throat> Excuse me. I am thankful for our days together, a time of teaching, building, and growing. These past days will sustain me until the truth comes. These past days will sustain me until the truth comes, until that peace that surpasses comes now in my day of decision. Lord, silence all the voices. Even well-meaning voices silence the voices of evil that would take me from your truth. My love, fill me with your peace and comfort while I wait for you in all things. Take all my fears as I wait and trust to the best of my abilities. Lord, I know you will. You will. Uh, uh, I know that you will greatly use this in my life. I will grow in wisdom, knowledge, and faith. With decisions looming, I choose you, my love, you. I choose your perfect will, my love. I will wait, even in the silence, our uh, you are at work on my behalf. Glory to God. I will not be pressured as many in the world are. I will not be pressured as many in the world are. These are your ways. I know my love, my my concerns foremost before you, Lord, light up the pages of your word. Lead me through to the words of life and wisdom therein. I will search you out in my abiding faith. Glory to God. In all this time of decision, I will continue to lift up holy hands in thanksgiving. This is what we do when we fret over decisions that are looming. We forget to lift up our hands in praise. We're at that altar constantly waiting to hear that word, right? But we're not lifting up our hands in praise. Amen. And often the answers come as we are praising. Amen. I will search you out in my abiding faith in all the time of decision. I will continue to lift up my hands in thanksgiving. You are ever so faithful and loving. Oh, my Lord your peace is not like those in the world. I have a hope within me and knowing and ever presence, always abiding glory to God. Where could I go from your spirit? I will wait. I will trust you until the end of days, my love, even though my heart longs to leave this place with all its turmoils and decisions. I will wait upon you, my love, for all of time to the best of my human abilities. Glory to God. And that's when the grace kicks in church. That's when the grace kicks in because our God knows we can only work within those parameters of the best of our abilities until the Holy Spirit moves upon us. Amen. To the best of my human abilities, glory to God. That's when our grace is ever present. Thank you, Lord. My love, even this very morn, with all my decisions, with all my turmoil, your peace falls upon me. These words of truth comfort me as I continue to wait. I choose you, my love. I will never leave your side or fall away. I know that I am yours and you have chosen me for such a day as this, that you are with me, that you care for me as no other. You are my love already know what is needed the way I should go glory to the lamb of God I lift up holy hands I honor your name above all others there's that again in this word continue to praise amen our answers often come as our hands are lifted to heaven and we're surrendered to him when we praise thanksgiving we are surrendered to him amen so don't fail to lift up holy hands, amen, in thanksgiving, amen. You are the Alpha and Omega. I place all that is within me now in your hands. You love me with your whole heart. Uh, 
I love you with my whole being. Glory to the Lamb. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Almighty God, for your presence, Lord God. Thank you, Lord God, that you are with those in this time of decision, Lord God, that it is not for them to waste time pondering, Lord God, in our flesh, Lord God. That will wear us out so quickly, Lord God, but to not forget to lift up our hands in thanksgiving and wait upon you, even though we are in the silence right Right now, you are working at our behalf, on our behalf. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Okay, second reading, Philippians 4, 4 through 9, in the time of decision. There is none like you, my love. You are my all in all. When you are with me early, I know you will be with me late. I need you so, my love, need you so. There is no end to all of your mercies, new every morning. Uh, today, my love, is a day of many decisions. I seek your wisdom early, and I long for only your voice. You will... Uh, you will be with me in this crowded and noisy world. I lay down all before you, my love. I pray only your will. This is the day I lay all before you. I have struggled and pondered long enough, my love. So somebody is at the end of their flesh, a very good place to be. Amen. Thank you, Lord. We all do this. We all do this, don't we? We all waste time pondering and struggling in our flesh. Amen. I give up myself and hold and hand over all to you, my love. I know your perfect timing and I hear your voice in this matter. I have no solutions in my fleshly mind. I will not give up. I know you are with me and you know the way forward. Glory to God. Often, my love, there is a time when the answer is just silence, a time of praying, a time of waiting, and a time of trusting. Today, a day of many decisions, a time when my mind says you must move in this direction. Oh, my love, my faith now being tested and tried as never before in the past, and yet you are with me. Your spirit moves within me from past days until today. You will lead me into the future glory. I am thankful for all of our days together, a time of teaching, building, and growing. These past days will not sustain me until the truth comes, until that peace that surpasses comes. Now in all my days of decision, Lord, silence all the voices of well-meaning men. Silence the voices of evil that would take me from your truth. My love, fill me with your peace and comfort while I wait upon you in all things. Take all of my fears as I wait and trust to the best of my abilities. Lord, I know you will uh, you will greatly use this in my life. I will grow in wisdom, knowledge, and faith. With decisions looming, I choose you, my love. I choose your perfect will, my love. I will wait even in the silence. You are at work on my behalf. Glory to God. I will not be pressured as so many in the world are. These are not your ways. I know my love, my concerns foremost before you. Lord, light up the pages of your word and lead me through the words of life and wisdom there within. I will search you out in my abiding faith. Glory to God. In all this time of decision, I will continue to lift up holy hands in thanksgiving as you are ever so faithful. Oh, my love, your people are not like those in the world. We have a hope within and knowing you are ever present, always abiding. Glory to God. There, Where could I go from your spirit? I will wait. I will trust you until the end of days, even though my heart longs to leave this place and uh, with all the turmoil and decisions, I will wait upon you, my love, for all of time to the best of my human abilities. My love, even this very morn, with all my decisions, with all my uh, turmoil, your peace falls upon me. Somebody needed to hear this. Let me read that again. My love, even this very morn, with all of my decisions, with all of my turmoils, your peace falls upon me. These words of truth comfort me as I continue to wait. I choose uh, you, my love. I will never leave your side or fall away. I know I am yours and you have chosen me for such a day as this. 
this tunnel I will pass through with you and you are with me and you care for me as no other. You are my love already. You know what is needed and the way I should go. Glory to the Lamb. I lift up holy hands. I honor your name above all. You are the Alpha and the Omega. I place all that is within me now in your hands. I love you with my whole heart and I love you uh, pardon me. I love you with my whole being. Glory to the Lamb. Thank you, Almighty God. Thank you, Almighty God. Bless you, Lord God. Such a beautiful word. You are his faithful one. He's just reconfirming. He's building you up. He's just coming beside you as you wait in the silence in this time of decision. He is with you. He is going before you. He knows you are in a dark tunnel and he knows you are moving. Not You are not moving quickly in your flesh and you are doing the best to your abilities and you are waiting upon him and you will grow through this. You will learn more and more and grow in new depth, saith the Lord. Praise God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. This is such an awesome word. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Lord, I lift up your people today, Lord God. I pray the blood that saves, Lord God, the blood that protects, Lord God. I pour your blood upon your people, Lord God, as many of us are in a tunnel. Many of us are in a waiting room, Lord God. Many of us are experiencing your silence, and yet, Lord God, we know that you are at work on our behalf, and we will trust in you, Lord God. We know who you are. We trust in you from the past. We will trust you today, and we will trust you tomorrow, Lord God. We all long to be in your presence and yet we know Lord God there's still work to be done on this earth before you come for us and we trust you in all things Lord God protect your people save their loved ones Lord God save their children and their grandchildren heal their bodies Lord God touch your people today in Jesus name comfort your people today God give them your peace Lord God give them your peace in Jesus name amen amen real quick I wanted to direct you to uh, tw uh, 12 Shortcuts to God. It was a video I did uh, about a week ago, and uh, some of you wrote to me. You journaled some of those little tidbits I call, I titled it 12 Shortcuts to God, and I would refer you back to that 10-minute video. If you would listen to that, if that moves you, if that gets you to thinking, if that's something you want to hear more often, maybe every couple of weeks I am writing, and I will post a few more 12 Shortcuts to God, but I would like your uh, input if you would like to see this up every couple of weeks, if it gets you to thinking. Amen. So God protect you today. Be safe today and be blessed today. You are a child of the King. Amen and amen. God bless.